Hey guys, it's Kira here, and today I'm starting a brand new series called The A to Z of a Space. And I just, I love making videos, and I thought, why not make a new series? So, here I am. So first up, let's talk about asteroids. Not to scare you, but only in April 2020, an asteroid was detected passing by the Earth. This was more than a mile wide, travelling at a speed of about 19,000 miles an hour. This space rock was expected to make its closest approach at 10.56am British Standard Time, when it was roughly just 3.9 miles away, about 16 times the distance between the Earth and the Moon. There are three main types of asteroid, C, S and M types. The first type is made of clay and silicate rocks and is dark in colour. The C stands for chondrite. The S type is made of silicate materials and nickel iron. The S stands for stony. The M types are magnetic and made of nickel iron. Did you know differences between the asteroid's makeup is due to how far from the sun they formed? Also, did you know, asteroids are primarily found in the asteroid belt. The asteroid belt is one astronomical unit thick, or AU. Talking of AU... An astronomical unit, or AU, is a unit of length about the distance from the Earth to the Sun. It's roughly 93 million miles or 150 million kilometres. Did you know Mars is about 0.52 AU away from the Earth? Well, Jupiter is 4.2 AU away from the Earth. AU is only one measurement we use to measure space. Kilometres and light years are two other ways. The Aurora Borealis is a beautiful light show that you can see around the North Pole, while the Aurora Australis is a beauty around the South. Greens, blues, reds and pinks. It's an amazing spectacle to view. These dancing colours are formed by the solar winds of the Sun, causing disturbances in the magnetosphere. The types of aurora depends on how fast the particles are moving. Well, that's all for now. I'll be back soon with some more Fat Finding the Universe A to Z. Please like, share, and subscribe.